As promised, let's talk a little bit about how modeling works in Blender. The workspace itself can already tell us a lot on what modeling entails. As you can see, the object is in edit mode, which is very important for modeling, since it relies on manipulating the vertices, edges, and faces of a mesh. You'll also notice that the modeling workspace opens the quick tools menu on the left for us already. While in edit mode, the left hand side quick tools menu provides several more tools for us to use, including extrude region, bevel, knife, and loop cut, to name a few important ones. We'll go into more detail about some of these tools in their own videos. The modeling workspace also automatically brings us to the modifiers tab of our properties editor. Modifiers are very useful during modeling and we'll be going over a few of those in their own videos as well. Additionally, there are several more options up here at the top of the viewport now that we're in edit mode. Each of these menus will give you additional operators to work with during modeling. That being said, most basic functions will be available through the quick tools menu alone. Just to demonstrate real quick, let's say we want to model a chair. You can do that very easily in the modeling workspace by simply selecting the appropriate tools. I'll be going over exactly how I made this chair as we learn more about the modeling tools.